morning. It's Thursday the 24th of May 2018. I'm at Murfield today. We've just come from Cottingley on the 1027. It's a Northern Strike Day, uh, or if you prefer a Strike Day on Northern. So the services provided by them are not great today. So anyway, the one we did use was the uh, what would have been Southport, but uh, so it's only Rochdale today. And uh, we're going to change on to the Grand Central service here, which is for King's Cross. It's due in about uh, eight minutes or so. So we're going to go to Doncaster with that, then Sheffield, and then Chinley, and hopefully walk to Strines. Um, if there's any chance of doing it the other way around, which I prefer to do personally, we may do that. But uh, at the moment, it's looking like Chinley, Tuss, Strines, and back on there, but we'll see. We will. So uh, let's do it. Let's wait for the Grand Central service. Right, this is our next train now, straight through to Doncaster. So taking this to Doncaster, then on to Sheffield, and then we'll go to Chinley and walk to Strines. Uh, if there's a possibility of going past it and then coming back, I might do that, but we'll see. Third one. We're now on the uh, Grand Central service to Doncaster, King's Cross train. And then we'll go to Doncaster and then go to Sheffield. We'll just about to start moving now. We're on our way. 10.55 or 10.56, one minute late. So, nothing to split the dummy out of it. It's so slackly timed as this service anyway. So uh, we'll see how it goes. Right, not far from Doncaster now. So um, we're going to get off here and then head over to uh, Manchester Piccadilly. So we are going to go straight through past Strines to Manchester and then come back to Strines by Manchester something. So that's the plan of action for now. So we're just outside Doncaster. I want to leave my iPad plugged in as long as possible. So, which rail platform? One or three, I would think. Can't leave anything else, I don't think, can I? It could be four or eight, it's very unlikely. Surprising this train though, it's so slackly timed. Oh, I thought this truck down there. Whatever that is. Right, we're moving into the station now. Should be platform one, it is. It's a flyover line there, Hexthor Bentley. Be great if there's no passenger service across that. Right, it's got the road, F for fast line I would think. And it's about to go. I 
So we've just come on this train from Murfield. Covering what you might say is the interesting bit. Next up King's Cross, which will be on this service at the end of June. Or earlier one actually, but we go to Wex. had to film this world speed record HST 30th anniversary of power car 43 102 reaching 148 and a half miles an hour on 1st November 1987 still stands today a world speed record for diesel traction it's a pity they don't run at that speed all the time he hasn't cleared the points it's just sat over the point there so he can't actually get our train in Bradford train at 12.35, it's actually going off this platform at the top end, platform 3B. So I don't know how or why it's doing that. It's not with platform 4 or 8. Anyway. So this is the uh, the iconic look of the uh, HST, which is 40 years old. We've been watching that programme on TV about the HSTs. And, uh, Excellent it is, I bet they're still here in about another 20 years time. Wouldn't be at all surprised. There's some green light there, it's not gone back to red yet, I thought that would have gone back to red. Anyway, off it goes. I think he's only just come from York as this one actually. which is the Manchester Airport Trans Pennine is scheduled to be departing from platform 3B at the top end here then it will cross over through the middle of the station to get to the Sheffield line so we'll be doing that fairly soon uh, sorry freight train going around the back there two way goods Edinburgh service now approaching One formation. Don't forget these are about what 30 years old or so now, aren't they? Or well, thereabouts. Started in the early 90s, so late, very late 80s to Leeds. And they've never really gone 140 mile an hour like they were supposed to be doing. Right, we've got an express here, a Virgin Express going straight through, non stop, straight to York. I presume it's non-stop straight to York from King's Cross. Doesn't seem to be going as fast as it used to do. Right, the Grand Central one has just left. And I think that Trans Pennine unit out there is going to be our next train to uh, Manchester Piccadilly. The 
there's quite a few passengers for this one because obviously there's not many northern services about today. It's moving. Is it just one three car unit or is it a six car formation? Just a three, just one unit. There's one Tuckleaf Ops over there heading in the opposite direction. This is ours. So we'll actually go through Chinley to start with, but we'll uh, come back a bit later to get to that butcher shop that we like going to. For your safety and security, this train is fitted with CCTA. Please keep your belongings with you or in sight at all times. If you notice anything suspicious, so the please speak to the South member Curve, of staff which or text the British Transport Police on 61016. If you tour. see it, say it and we'll sort it. Right, we're just leaving Meadow Hall. Next up, Sheffield. We'll see the old Brightside station very shortly. We had some go on this train. As you know how people with mosh pits mosh their head back and forth. This clothes are still in that and it was going like proper mad. This train is from Manchester Airport and we'll be calling at Sheffield, Stockport, Manchester Piccadilly and Manchester Airport. He stopped to come to the front of that straight back to the Yeah, there's no extra track on this side, like there's on the other side. This is what was bright side now, shut in 1995 I believe, correct me if I'm wrong. There's another line that used to come across from Tinsley just here, that's long gone now is that. This is what used to link on, just there. Long close is that one. There's still some loops here though for freight trains. Oh, to stable units as needs be. Sheffield Forge Masters. Right, we're just coming into Sheffield, a little quicker than normal, but uh, we've obviously got the road straight into the platform, which I would imagine is platform six. Went past it that quick, I didn't see. Most likely be six or eight, I don't think. Six is the main southbound platform here. Oh yeah, I got a platform eight. 
we are going into platform A. Yeah, platform's on the right hand side. <laughs> Stop for now. This is the main line from Crewe and London, Euston, and Chester further over. So, ladies and gentlemen, we shall be rolling into Stockport Station. Passengers leaving the train, please ensure you take personal belongings with you. Thank you for travelling with Transpennine Express. Once again, we shall be arriving into Stockport. Thank you. We will shortly be arriving at Stockport. If you are leaving the train, please make sure you take I don't know why they bother with the automated announcements, it's so annoying. It looks good just do it. <laughs> Any customers exiting this station, please retain your tickets to operate the automatic ticket bay. That's line from Chester. So you see lights in the house, yes. Yeah, Fellow passengers. It's a little bit of a hand Stockport sidings. <laughs> so you can stop port now. I think we're going down the slow line, but we'll soon find out. It tends to be fast line in this direction, slow line the other way. So it's just stop port viaduct. Quite notable. Some idiot down there on the double yellow line. Here's the M60. It's nice for some reason. down there a few times. Heat at Norris Junction now, where the Lancaster Stanley Bridge goes off on the opposite side. It's going past Long Sight now, not far from Manchester Piccadilly, where we're going to get off. And we'll hopefully do the 1419 from Union Central, almost all the way through, getting off at Strines. <laughs> this is Universal Square, which is opposite Hardwick. Hardwick is over there, where we were earlier. Very handy for Universal Square. And whatever else, Universal Buildings. Right, we've got to get ready and get off. Passengers 
don't know what they call that, a northern service, but it's not a northern service, it's TPE. That's ridiculous. Well anyway, our train is on platform one for Strines. So we'll just cross over here. We came on to nine as books, it's fine. Come a long way around, but anyway, we'll get the 1419 Newell Central Platform 1. So, is it both those 142s? Or just one of them, I wonder? We'll soon find out. I went to Paynton then, they have Voyager. Oh, all that bloody way to Paynton. No, thank you. Don't think we get on it yet. Never been off here before, but we've even stopped at it. So we'll get on when we can. That's Strines, we're going to Strines on this one. So this is a northern service that is running. And uh, should be the Strines. 14.45 arrival into Strines and we'll walk over to Chinle uh, that way. Okay, so this is 2B, 2, 2, 2S6. This is 2S36, 14.19 Manchester to go to Newman Central. Okay. The details on the screen anyway, so we'll have some time on that. Right, so let's do it. Right, so you're in Manchester Piccadilly now, heading for Strines. Got to create a bay platform, isn't it? Platform zero. Where that unit is. It's all extra space. Because <coughs> <coughs> we're going Guy Bridge Way, aren't we? I'm not going through Guide Bridge, we're going on that line and have to turn right at Ashford's. Short 
tunnel we just went through there, I think actually goes underneath the canal. And this has connections of course to Miss Marple and Joan Hickson, well, the Agatha Christie books. So there's a lot of uh, reference to that. There it is. So ours is next now, Strines. Right, so that was Marple now. Our next station is the where we get off now, Strines. Never been off here before. Walking over to Chinley. been off here before so let's uh, let's do this we've got a couple of hours to walk to Chinley before that shop closes one more stop to go now and that's end of journey intended doing this a month or two back but uh, so far we've not done it until now not many not many trains actually for Sheffield stop here most of them miss it out Anyway, that is up both units. Nobody on, only me off. Right, right so we're going to walk to uh, Chinley now. And uh, I'll just check the map anyway first before we set off. Uh, I think we're on the right side to just keep going over this way, so this is this way we need to be. Nice little location, isn't it? Passing trains cause air turbulence, I don't think so. Right, well, I thought we were coming back then, but probably that'll reverse at New Mill Central and ever and come back I think almost straight away. Right. Oh my word. Little tiny waiting shelter. That is really tiny that isn't it? So what's at Strines ticket machine? Yeah it's like a ticket machine on that side. Which is probably the more used side to board. And this will be the lighting something of many people on here, I wouldn't think. There's a an information and assistance thingy, if it works, I'm not too sure, I can't bother using it, but anyway, we're down this way now, I'm sure, and out of the station. So let's just check where we're going first. Right, it's come down from the station there, and this is the way we're going up here. Oh 
I'll do a few Facebook lives as we go. Somebody else having a walk as well around here. No bloke. about a couple of hours to get to Chinley before that shop shuts which is slightly annoying <coughs> afternoon oh, yeah. the pub up here didn't they yeah that'll do I don't know about getting out to eat, but I'll have something to drink, certainly. Right, there's a pub somewhere up here. Ah, here it is. Fox in. Let's check it out. Just look at this view here. Eh? Is this fantastic or what? You can see the railway up there. I think that that is the main line. Where Stockport. I might be wrong. Pan round, it's like a farm or some horses there. Look at the hills at the top there, it's almost silhouetted because of the sun. Right, we'll do another Facebook Live. I'll we'll put this camera away first. Right, the train we're waiting for now is, uh, is over 40 minutes late, it's about three quarters of an hour late roughly. It did say it was cancelled earlier but it's still coming it's still not listed on the what's it up there the uh, digital readout or whatever you want to call it digital display oh the sun's hopeless so is that a bit better it isn't it my face is hopeless so yeah we're just still waiting for that train and um, it's past new mills south junction by now so it's not far away just hope it stops here. I can't see any reason why it shouldn't. So um, let's just wait for it now. Uh, ah! Here we are. Well, that was our train and it has failed to stop. This train is the delayed 1809. The details are on the screen anyway, so and how late it is. <laughs> so we'll get this through to Sheffield and we'll work out what we're going to do from there onwards after that. I'm totally and completely pissed off with the East Midlands trains and Northern for being on strike. It's absolutely unforgivable. This is absolutely rammed, is this one? It is. Although I suspect a lot of passengers are getting off here, so <coughs> let's just see how many get off here. Because it will be a hell of a fucking lot. What the hell's been going on? Singer. What the hell has been going on? I've been sat here in two hours! No! Yes! You think it's funny, do you? Right, well there'll be one hell of a claim going in. Right, we have finally made it to Sheffield. A uh, lot of northern services here stood idle because they're all on strike, a lot of them. So we're going to find a train now to get to uh, Leeds. Not sure what it'll be. Not 
Nottingham, right now. What's that? Fair to Willow. Norwich. Uh, let's have a look and see what we're going to get. Right, this is our next train. The late running Cleethorpe service. Details on screen. So we're just, ta just taking this to Meadow Hall and we'll have a look at Meadow Hall for a bit. Right, just leaving Sheffield now on the Cleethorpe service. Just snipping to Meadow Hall on here, and then we'll have a little bit of time there. So you can see all the Northern services all parked up that's uh, not being used. Bang out of order, but what can you do? I think it's time to start sucking some people. They won't work. We're actually backwards just briefly here, just to Meadow Hall. We'll probably go back in on the tram. But uh, we'll see, Not nothing certain. Right, we're in Meadow Hall now. We'll have to end this video here now because the battery's just about at it. So, till we make another video, it's bye for now.